I'm Lizzie Daston. Welcome to another session of Sidewalk School. We are in the downtown arts district right in front of the container yard, which is one of the most energized street art spaces in LA in front of a particular work that is one of my favorites. It is a collaborative mural by Michael B. and Bumblebee Loves You. Something that I love about this work is the way that these two artists are able to synthesize their styles, which are so different from each other, into a mural that really is cohesive. Bumblebee's work on the street utilizes these figures of little kids. Now the content of his work explores and celebrates childhood, and typically the figures that he paints are kids and the world of a child is so small and contained and I think there's just something really lovely about what happens when that kid is suddenly massive and the game that he plays in that inner space of his mind is all of a sudden plastered on a wall and so there's a play there with scale and how something that is intimate changes and transforms when suddenly it's really large. Michael B, he started out as a graffiti writer in Denmark and his style has gone through a big evolution from graffiti to graphic design and now to contemporary work that is sometimes on the street, sometimes on a canvas. And he's retained aspects of each of these iterations in his style. He sometimes has some wild style graffiti and in the work behind us we have a little bit of that lettering, a little homage to his roots. And often there's this graphic, really energized aesthetic that is visually pleasing and also nuanced and slightly complicated because of his use of color and the way that he layers those colors together. But Michael B, his style is non-objective, which means it's abstract, and Bumblebee's is entirely rooted in the figure. And so what happens when these two worlds collide? The work behind us is a result of that collision. I think that it's unexpected because you would never necessarily pair these two artists together, but the end product is just magic. The way that I read this work is a little boy, he unleashes his creativity, his creative mind, using a spray can as his vehicle. And so notice that he just seems so wild and free and happy and uninhibited by society and expectations. And the product of that freedom is Michael B's design. And I think that this is a really successful, they like it too. I think this is a really successful moment when two different styles of street art align together to form something that really elevates both artist practice. I'm Lizzie and this has been another session of Sidewalk School.